and, and, and maybe work with you. I'm going to film myself a little bit. Is this filming? Yeah, good. Is that me? Am I there? Well, whatever. Um, see, your idea is very prudent because she knows, she knows she would like to make clothes. She wants them to be everyday clothes, but she wants to make them her mark. I can't remember her name, Young Mullen or something like that. And she wants to say to people, okay, it's just a coat, but this is my idea. This is a better coat. And the employees are well paid, and we use very good materials. And this is my point of view. I always wanted a coat or a scarf or shoes like this. So that would be like her product. And fashion and clothing is very, you know, you have good years and bad years. So your idea is very good because maybe if I gave her 5 million euros, your idea would be good. She would, she would invest it for like one year and make some more money because you, you'll have periods of time when business will not be very good. Yeah. Very prudent. Yeah. Do you know what kind of business it would be? Let's say that one year goes by and, and you, you're prepared to invest in the dollar. That's, that's fine. Um, at the end of one year, what would you do if you made more money? Yeah, what type of business would it be? Brendan's not sure yet what he wants to do. Uh, what sort of business would you do? Let's say one year goes by and you made good investments. And now it's... Business. Yeah. I do Joe's business. Joe's business? Yeah. <laughs> Jewelry? Yeah, you love jewels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. J'avais une jolie bague uh, la semaine dernière et, et c'est déjà rayé. C'est un saphir. I don't know how it happened. Oh, yeah, with the braquage, it's just... Oh, yeah. Yeah. I still have the ring, but it seems to have scratched, so I must... He loves jewels. And he wants to build houses for the poor. And she wants to do some sort of thing in Africa for giving classic education to students. And she likes bars, and she would like to give a, a nice uh, drink to the, to the young children with no alcohol, and maybe a little something for the adults. Yeah, although not in Africa. Yeah. And this lady is interested in having an exclusive restaurant in China. And this lady, what did you say that you wanted to do? A what? That's right. She wants to do a classic traditional bookstore. Yeah. But she she wants it to be more like people could drink coffee there and stay there all day. You know, but but a nice place for people to talk where they could actually drink something and, and relax. I think it's a good idea. And uh, also, they could have samples of the books that people maybe could look at for free for a short period of time. You know, like 15 minutes. You know. Because you don't want to give them the books for free to read. It's not a, it's not a library. It's a bookstore. But it, it could be fun. They could touch the books directly. They could meet other people and talk to them. And she's interested in her own region and her own language. But if she detects that there are other people in her hometown that speak another language, she will add other materials and events. Yeah. Well, we could do something great together. <laughs> it would be really fun. Yeah. But two, what would you like to do? Um, He's starting with investing. He wants to build more money and maybe decide in one year. Maybe you should do what he suggests, you know. 
Because if somebody gives you 5 million euros, his idea is very smart. He's thinking, okay, I'm not really sure right now. I, uh, okay, great, I'll stop school. But I don't know yet. I want to invest it and make more money. Yeah, which would be a good idea for this lady here who wants to do clothing, which is rather cyclical, you know. And also for this lady who wants to have a, a tropical bar, sometimes there are, uh, there's bad weather in the Caribbean. So she might have a bad year when she doesn't have very many people come to visit, you know. So it might be a good idea to invest your money for the first year and then decide. But the person who's giving, like, say, 5 million euros would say, no, Fatu, you must stay for 20 years. When you decide what it's going to be, you must be the manager. I want you. So you would have to think because you'll already be in your 40s when you, maybe you could retire then. You know, ça sera joli, la retraite à 45 ans, quelque chose comme ça. That would be really nice. Yeah, yeah, maybe less. Yeah, 10 years, yeah. But let's say that there would be a contract and they would say to, to you, okay, but we want you. Yeah, he has an interesting idea, right? Because in the Caribbean, you know, they have bad years. Yeah. But if you invested the money, you could close the, the bar properly and, and protect it and go away for six months. Yeah, and you could come back after six months. You could, well, uh, yeah. No, no, no. Ah, she wants to run off. But I, I don't know. I don't think they would let you. But uh, he has, he, I think he has a good idea. Uh, to, to, and, and Fatou isn't sure what she wants to do. Yeah. Yeah. Aha. Would you be prepared to stop school now if, if somebody gave you a big opportunity? Yes. Yeah. Because you know, you could always decide in the future to take six months off or one or two years off and finish your diploma. That's what I did. Several times I got jobs, so I stopped school. I stopped. But I went back like one or two years later and I, and I studied some more. Yeah. You don't. I don't want to promote rebellion, but you don't necessarily have to keep going if you find a good opportunity. Uh, Fatou, if you were going to invest the money until you decided, let's say we said, okay, you can have an extra year, where would you put the money? He likes the U.S. dollar. Yeah, and some money funds and things like that. What would you do with the money? How would you make more money? Uh, <coughs> yeah. Just an ordinary bank? No, safe. What? What? What is safe? <laughs> <laughs> um, um, quoi? Yeah, yeah. You could always you could always buy something a commodity and take possession of it. You know, quelque chose avec un vrai valeur comme comme l'or. Yeah. Ou l'argent. Yeah. La bière? Le vin? W wine, yeah. He could invest in wine, actually. Uh, there's always a market for wine. Yeah, if you're, but if you're going to, if you're going to invest in a commodity, you have to find a place to keep it. Yeah, yeah. But he he could rent a good calf, you know, or maybe two or three of them to to, to distribute. Yes. Yeah. 
but the Levar is very good in Alsace. The, the wine is very good in Alsace. Yeah, le Bordeaux is a peu lourd, but il y a quelques qui sont pas mal. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting idea. He he might invest some of it. He likes gold. He likes silver. He's interested in wine. I think. I think that if you got one or two or three deals with wine cellars, Cav, he could store some. And I think I think that two or three places is a good idea, because if there's a an earthquake or a problem with the weather, your stock is not all in one place. You know, yeah, yeah. But but too, where would you put the money? I buy a big house. I buy a big house. She ah, would invest in real estate. Very big house. Bien immobilier. Yeah. Why? Why? Mais il faut penser. Ça sera revendu éventuellement. Yeah. You won't stay there for the rest of your life. But she could live there for one year in a nice palace. I know. Yeah. Yeah. There, there are potential problems with real estate, but if it's a really good property, it's probably a pretty good investment. Yeah. And she, but she, let's say that Fatou buys a beautiful palace, okay? You're interested in that also. And you could stay there for one year, a great year, and just invest money, you know, and, and improve the palace. I mean, take good care of it, and then look for a buyer. But then after one year, it's time to get to work. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that would be nice for her because she could she could rest and relax and work on her investment before she goes to Africa. Yeah. Chinese ladies, if you do f uh, business in China, how will you get the money? Let's say that I give you the money, okay? Where will you put the money when I give it to you? Will you keep it in your hands? Will you put it in a Chinese bank? Yeah.